How's it going guys? My name is MLG Gamer and welcome to another Slitherio video. So before I start, I want to talk to you guys about a new schedule. Um, yes. So I'm going to be um, launching videos every day of the week except for the weekends. Because I need time to rebuild the Survival Wave Castle. You guys probably know already I told you. My world corrupted and uh, the castle spawn point changed so when I died when I was recording it, it yeah, yeah it didn't work it, it, it I couldn't find my castle anymore so yeah I need time to do that but also I, I just need time to myself as well you know just to chill and you know because I, I, I also have this job and everything so you know anyway today I have a special guest on the channel He's personally one of my favorite characters from a very popular game, and he's playing Slytherio with us today. Introduce yourself, sir. Hello, magnificent people of the internet. It is I, the Great Papyrus. Since I have given up hunting humans, I have taken the, per the opportunity to play Slytherio for you all with MLG Gamer. Nice, guys. Papyrus is joining us today. How about that? That's amazing. So, Papyrus, you have already named yourself and everything. Do it. So, let's just choose your skin and we can begin. Right. Okay. So, what would befit a skeleton? A very confident skeleton. Ooh, what is this? I have no idea. This looks pretty good. Hmm. Oh, that looks cool. Ish. Maybe. Hmm. Just trying to figure out what befits a skeleton. It's very difficult. Ooh, that one looks like a fire. I'm not sure what that is. What is that, MLG Gamer? Hmm. That symbol... It's a K. I don't know what that is. Sorry guys, I'm not very familiar with that part of the internet, clearly. Who is this? The... That's Pewds, man. That that dude is one of the most popular YouTubers ever, and that's, they made a, a skin for him, a bro fist. Yeah, I love that guy, he's a boss. And that's Google Play. Hmm... I'm not finding anything suiting of a skeleton that I would love. Ooh, this rainbow one seems pretty cool. I'll use it. All right. So, MLG Gamer, what is Slitherio, anyway? I've, I've never really heard of it, per, per se. I've never really played it before. Well, it's basically like Snake, but um, you eat food, and you go against players as well. If they bump into you, you die, and... You get to eat their... They get to eat your remains, sorry, if you die anyway. Vice, and vice versa as well, because, well, you, they bump into you, they die, you get to eat their um, particles, or whatever those things are, anyway. So, let's begin, Papyrus. Let's just play online and we'll begin. So the great Papyrus is on Slytherio. Nice. Very nice. Very good. So tell me about yourself, Papyrus. Well, I am a skeleton who is an avid lover of puzzles and an unparalleled spaghettor. But guys, spaghettor means like those people who make spaghetti. In case you guys didn't know. I have a brother, Sans, and I'm a number of the I'm a member of the Royal Guard. Hmm, interesting. See, your life seems pretty interesting, man. Uh, so, I know a lot of stuff have happened to you. How did it feel when Frisk, or what it's supposed to be... Oh, that guy failed! That's awesome! You, you interrupted my question, uh, uh, Papyrus. Oh, yes, sorry. Yes. So, what, how do you feel when the guy who was supposed to be Frisk, or Frisk pretty much, ran into your puzzle, ran across, it, well, no, he 
Oh, that guy failed as well. Wow, I'm doing amazing. I really am doing great. Positively, absolutely amazing. So, like I was saying, how did it feel that... How did it feel when Frisk, or what is supposed to be Frisk, walked through your puzzles without you explaining them? Guys, so... Guys, listen to this really interesting... Um, comment here well it was um creepy he didn't even allow me to explain my puzzles i think sans felt very strongly about it not sure how he dealt with it though i can assure you he dealt with it oh yeah he definitely dealt with it so how does it feel to be a royal guardsman it feels great. It feels great. I mean, it's not what I hoped it to be, but uh, we protect humans now if they fall in the underground. And Adina is the ruler of the underground. She's super great and super strong. She might be the most LG person I've ever heard of. I know, right? So I heard you were a... Uh, you are a dozen away from a double digit account on social media. How has it gotten? Has it gotten any better since you are a, since you are a royal guard and since some people love you on YouTube? Well, sorry. So I say, um, it has gotten it has gotten a little bit better. A lot of royal guardsmen have been impressed that I helped the human, and we made it to the surface. I got so much recognition, I almost couldn't handle it. I think my ego went crazy on that day, by the way. <laughs> um, um, oh yes, I have one last question for you. What do you think about Sans and Toriel's funny relationship? I don't even know why. Um, well, they both seem to have an intense love for bad puns. Something I never liked. Um, so I'm not too fond of the relationship. But Sans seems to be enjoying himself more than he normally it does. So I guess it's okay. But if they overuse puns on me, I'm not going to be very happy here. I'm not going to be a very happy skeleton. Alright, Papyrus. So, so far I see you're doing very well, like 2,500 Papyrus, you, you, you know how to play this game. Ah, I've actually set up a puzzle before, which is similar to this. Really? Oh, how come we've never seen it, seen it before? Uh, it, I, I guess it was a deleted puzzle. I never really got, I never, I thought it, I didn't think it was good enough. So I never launched it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Papyrus, the, the, the intense lover of puzzles, love made one something like Slitherio. This guy is absolutely amazing. Oh, careful. Those two snakes are really close by. Oh my gosh. Oh, I have one last question for you, um, Papyrus. I just remembered what, what I was going to ask you again. So, you say you make some really good spaghetti. How would you rate your spaghetti? Well... Oh, no, this guy's trying to try to cat trap me. No way he's doing that. All right. Yeah, so... Spaghetti. All right, so, um... My spaghetti, I think it's of a high qu I think it, it tastes of high quality. I put hard work and effort into this, into, into my spaghettis. Oh no! It's frozen! No! Oh wait, it's going on. Oh, it's lagging. It's just lagging, guys. It's just lagging. That's all it is. Yeah, lag. I've never liked that in games. Hmm. Yeah. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Papyrus, it seems you ran into the edge of the thing. Yes. Very odd. The lag must have had something to do with it. 
wonder why. Well, Papyrus, I don't know why that lags so badly, but you want to try again? Sure! So, Papyrus, um, like you were saying, spaghetti. Um, right. So, the, uh, yeah, I rate my spaghetti as high quality, very high quality. For a skeleton, I have very high standards. All I always cook my spaghetti to perfection. Always. Literally. Always. That's, that's basically. Oh, that's a lot of food. Oh, wait. The guy went for it. Oh. Like I was saying, I always cook my spaghetti cooked to perfection. Always cook it to perfection. And that's what I like about Undyne as well. Since she's, she's kind of my, in a way, my role model. She's a very good cook. I love how she teach. She actually taught me how to. No! I died! Curses! Hmm. Oh, that's a little bit saddening. Yes, so Undyne taught me how to cook. Yes, apparently. Apparently, something happened while I was gone some time ago, and uh, I heard her house burnt down. I don't know why, but. You know? But at the same time, I was trying to get her and Frisk to be friends. Apparently they did hit it off, but, um, I don't know what happened, why her house burned. Um, so yeah, I don't really know. Afraid not. Wow. I'm pretty sure a lot of us know what happened there. A wink wink. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So Paris though, I think you do you did pretty well though. You got to two thousand. That was that was a pretty good try for your first try. You seem to know what you're doing, man. Yes, because I am for I am great and I know how to do stuff. And I have overwhelmingly powerful confidence. I can do anything. Good job, Papyrus, good job. Always got that confidence with you. You can do this. Also, I notice you're a skeleton who you're not one of the you know you're, you're not just one a person that we can look at every day and just like oh psh, this is a, a skeleton like I don't think like that you know you can look at him I all right let me put it this way guys I notice you're a skeleton I'm um, sorry papyrus I notice you are a skeleton when I when I first heard about the um, about Undertale I heard you you were a a skeleton who, how do I say it? You you see the good in people. Why well, yes. When Frisk turned all bad and walked through my puzzles, I did try to seek the good in him. That's what I believe. That's what I believe should everyone should do. But it appears that everyone doesn't always do it. Hmm. Well, that's a shame. Well, I believe the same like you, Papyrus. Seeing the good in everyone is a good idea. I think so. I personally think so. It's a good idea to be in, to to look and see the good in people, even if if even if they're all bad and all that. I believe to do so. By the way, guys, I'll see if I can try and get Undertale. I will not promise anything. I really do want to play it, but I I'll try and see if I can get it. But anyway. Papyrus man, you you're lasting a bit long now. You are so. Oh my goodness, that's a big snake. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh no, I died. Oh, the lag again. I messed. It glitched up my snake. Why did it glitch? Oh, well, that was um interesting. Well, Papyrus, it's good to have had you on our video today. Why, thank you, MLG Gamer. Thank you for having me. And I hope to see you again very soon. I hope to see you too. Very, very soon. So, guys, we're ending the video here. Um, so, Papyrus, man, he joined our, our, our video today, guys. How about that? 
I didn't expect to find him, but I finally did. Took a long time, but I did. Let me know if you guys like it. Like, I mean, let me know if you guys like the video. Let me know if you guys like my impression. Ask. You can comment in the comment section below if you think it's, you know, dusty. Needs a little bit of improvement. Whether you like it, whether you want to see more, or even if you just want me to stop already. I had kind of had some ideas about doing, about voicing Sans and Metaton, but you know. It's all right. It's all right. J just comment in the comment section below of what you think about this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.